911 uh, day, the day that most people in America, especially here, they don't give a shit about it. And the um, people in the Northeast, there's even people who say, it's time to forget. No, you don't forget, that was a disaster. Whitey was there, like, probably like a day or two after. All covered in dust and stuff. So it's a wagon. Did I put S? Yeah, I did. Yeah, a little bit. We got this thing from uh, Walmart. It was rusted. Rusted, so clean it up. Look. Freaking. Goddamn. I gotta clean that up. Um, tires were flat. It's like, alright, they're probably not bad. Tires were flat. These were sitting outside, 1999. Steel. Had some rust touch up paint. But the best thing was, see what's going on here? Why is this whole front axle loose? That's how they built it. I don't know, this is just, I don't even know why. I said we were going to put shit in. Go for the junkyard. We're going to use it, rent one for a dollar. And uh, this, the wheels are probably worth around 19 bucks, probably $10 a piece. So, yeah, we gotta fix that the truck. And we gotta upload videos. But yeah, we gotta get the other thing up. You know, a wheelbarrow now costs around like almost like $100 even for a cheap one. $100, used to be like thirty nine ninety nine. It's like a good one, heavy duty steel. And then get like a heavy duty steel one, they're like $200. Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me, America? It's, there's nothing to this. The Chinese, the tires are made in China, but didn't they used to have wooden little shim things? Now they're all plastic. I could have swore they used to have wooden ones. This is very uh, flimsy on the bottom, too. I was thinking about putting an additional piece of plastic or like a piece of stainless steel under it. I gotta get these stains up. Yeah, but no one wants to. Remember, or soon you're going to see in this country, which is the way it's going, especially if um, so-and-so people are uh, elected. Um, it's an old box, man. It's probably from my Kmart days. One of these wheels are made in Germany. They're old as hell. I don't want to use this one. But, um, it's going to be a time so they will say, we should forget. That's... It's, I'm just telling you, it's going to be a time. What generation is going to be? It's going to be a time. That's really messed up. Found wire wheel does that the best, and then just power wash it. Yeah, this car was there like day after. I think it, uh, they brought it there. It almost like it looked like a damn like police car almost. So yeah, caprices at the time. Go go uh, help out and walk around or whatever. The place was a mess. I got some really cool pictures. Uh, crazy old guy. And that was maybe some video too. This is totally trashed. All he had was uh, P95 masks. If that even did anything. I don't know. Those probably weren't even good. Yeah, this even a week after when he brought Whitey there. Um, yeah, I still remember. Don't forget though, don't forget that probably the, what they tell you, how those buildings came down too, is probably also a freaking hoax. No doubt planes were put into them, but I don't know. There's more to it. Okay. Lighten it up. Looks better on my, in real life, than on camera. Get acid stains off your bricks. Look at paint too. Get the old shittiest wire wheel you have. I don't know what that was. Gum too. It might pick up. People throw gum on this driveway a lot. It's dick.
Yeah. New barrel. I don't need a commercial mower. I keep looking. Actually, I thought they were a whole lot more money. They're cheap. I can get a used one. Sometimes I'll have like a hundred bucks. Scary. Down here. Nobody has any money, so the buying power of things used is uh, quite low. Like how I used to get snap on tools for cheap. Dent out of the side of whitey. See the bottom thing? Might come out. Get a good paintless guy. Pretty flattened. Load video of my belts. Um, yeah, the truck is fixed now. That was why I cut off it. This is the new alternator it needed. The clean on wiring and stuff. It's messed up on it. Um. Yeah, this thing needs to be repaired on its side, and I gotta paint this thing. I got money, so no problem. I got enough saved up. I'm cutting back a lot. You gotta work every every deal you can. You gotta work it. Then you can save thousands instead of buying stupid shit that you don't need. Um, you know what we're gonna do? I guess tighten those up. I'm gonna take these off too and clean those all up. I don't know how much wild I want to get on this. Shame they sell you stuff that just sits outside and it's rotted. I'm thinking number one, somebody bought this, or maybe they didn't even buy it and they put the wheels on, or these didn't come with the wheels on them, and then they're installed at the store, so they had no tools, so they just put finger tight. Or I don't know. Or maybe someone is trying to steal the wheels at night. I don't know. That's a Mexico company trooper. Yeah, wheelbarrow, like a hundred bucks now. On freaking real. Right, my tools still have belt changing. Stuff on them. Ah, uh, wheelbarrow tech 101. So I thought at first like I was gonna need a washer on the outside, but it doesn't come with any. And all it needed was you space those out more. Then you have less play side to side. Before it had too much play. That's okay. I hate when the wheels rattle around. That's alright. Gonna go out a little more on here, but I'm not gonna go crazy. Cool. Fixed it. No washer required. I took this wheel off thinking it was fucked up, but it's not. I'll fix it up. It's gonna rust, no doubt about that. I was gonna go spray all the shit in there too. Get the hell out of it. So this thing says like assembled somewhere over there. National Assembly Assemblers.net. Assembled by. And they put all these things backwards. It's supposed to go this way. Not this way. Fucking idiots. 